So, big news from Legend of Korra. Uh, apparently, remember when I said that the initial report said that January 2015 would be the release date for Book 4 Balance? Well, uh, recently, and I say recently, a, two, a day or two ago, it has been announced by Nickelodeon that Legend of Korra Book 4 Balance will premiere this October, of, you know, October 3rd of this year. Yeah. That's not even nearly a month away. That's like almost, that's half a month away. So, and these will premiere online, like I said. And, yeah, I guess Nickelodeon really just wants to get this over with. Now, this is kind of, it's kind of cool, but at the same time, it's kind of sad to see it go. Because, here's the thing. Korra, book three was such a massive improvement. It had its bumps, don't get me wrong, it had its, uh had its rough spots, but it wasn't nearly as bad as book two was. And I look back at book one, and I see some good in it. There were some good... Amon wasn't the only problem in there, and Amon's backstory. I mean, Korra herself was not a great character, but there were some things in book one that you could see uh, being good on its own. However, with book two, you could say that, you know, begin it, you can start from beginnings, and that's where you see the good stuff. Granted, the whole inner spirit thing I still think is a load of bullshit. Uh, but yeah, this... Uh, th but however, having my grievances with book two, book three clearly is massively superior. Once again, I have to say that it did have its minor problems. They weren't like blaringly bad as they were with book one and two. So, yeah, I guess... Now, the big thing is... Uh, I guess Nickelodeon just wants to end Legend of Korra and end this chapter. I mean, not just end this chapter, end this... Just close the door on all of this, finally. They just want to end it at last. Now, this kind of makes me wonder, did they uh, did uh, they already finish, wrap up book four? I mean, uh, I, get, I assume so. I guess they were working in tandem on seasons on book three and four. So I can only imagine that they were uh, that I guess they worked on it, and it's the same animation studio. Uh, uh, yeah, it is the still it's still Studio Mir doing the animation studio. But I am curious to know were they for, were they uh, were they promised they were going to get some more time, or did they were like no fuck it we're just going to premiere them now on Nick.com, and that's going to be it. It is kind of sad that the ratings were so low and that it, that you know it's not going to be on TV because I kind of miss it. I kind of miss Cora. Back on TV. I heard it's going to be on Nick. T it's gonna book three is gonna be the rest of book three is gonna be on Nicktoons. That uh, it's like the boomerang of uh, of Nickelodeon in a way. Unless, but it does have all the anime there as well. But anyway, but I digress. Um, I am. Don't get me wrong. I am really excited for book four, but at the same time, I'm kind of sad to see it go because. Yeah, at the end of this, you know, pretty much towards somewhere in Dece like mid November or, or December, this this universe is going to end. I mean, it's still going to be around in Dark Horse Comics apparently. Dark Horse has announced that they still have the li comic book license to this, and we still have a few video games. I'm not going to play them because they're usually terrible. But yeah, I am really uh, interested to see where they can go. And why they kind of made the decision? Why not? Just, why why not wait for a little while? But again, again, I can understand the fans wanting to see it sooner. Um, but again, it just kind of shows that yeah, this ended in what August, and now we have a month break, and then it continues. Don't get me wrong, I am excited. I have to keep stressing that. But on the other hand, it's like, were, was this planned or was this uh, Nickelodeon's call to do this? I don't really know. I mean, were they just like, hurry the fuck up, hurry the fuck up. We got. I'm tired. We're tired of Korra. You know, she needs to go, be the last a Avatar or whatever. I, I'm paraphrasing for Nickelodeon. I can only imagine what they say. But yeah, um, I am excited to see where this goes. Again, I'm really uh, interested to see how Korra get if if at all if Korra if at all can get back on her feet after such a devastating uh, hit like that from. From book from the end of book three, I'm kind of curious to see that. I'm really interested to see the effects of the Air Nation returning and Jinora being the leader of uh, not Tenzin, but Jinora being the leader of the of the uh, the Air Nomad people. 
And, of course, I'm really curious to see, are we going to get the Fire Nation? I'm hoping we get to see the Fire Nation again. I want to see Zuko's daughter. I, we heard, we've heard nothing but... We've heard everything about her, you know? She's mentioned all the time of, you know, her being the Fire Lord. Uh, can we finally see Zuko's daughter and, you know, finally say, hey, if this is May's daughter, you know, Zuko and May's daughter, or as the comics are going, May is it Zuko and Suki's daughter? I have no fucking clue. Also, I'm kind of curious to see what's going on in the Earth Kingdom. You know, the Earth Kingdom's kind of gone down the shitter after what Zaheer did. But, any, uh, but I digress. Uh, so once again, you guys tell me, what do you guys think of the news of Legend of Korra Book 4 coming sooner? Do you guys like the idea? Do you guys hate it? Let me know in the comments below. And yeah, once again, hope you guys enjoyed this, and I'm out.